We're at the TM Forum Digital Disruption event here in San Jose, and I'm with Alfred Binford, who is the President and CEO of MyCom North America. Thanks a lot for taking some time with me. Now, you've just come on board with yes. MyCom yes. after a, a, a very um, strong and quite high-profile career through, uh, through operators and through some major industry players. What I'd be really interested in to start with is what were the, the key decision points that brought you into MyCom? Oh, great. Thank you. Well, thanks for uh, mentioning my career was high profile. I guess my mom paid you to say that, right? <laughs> um, well, actually, I spent my whole career uh, in telecom and technology. So obviously, having a chance to join MyCom at this very pivotal stage of the company's existence was very attractive to me. It's never easy to, to change jobs, but when you change, you have to think about how will moving to this new company allow me to do what I love, which is literally to help operators, to help communication service providers grow their business much faster than they could without the services we offer. So obviously I'm excited about bringing you know, over a quarter century of experience to MyCom and helping the company get to the next phase, which we're very excited about. And what, what were the big differentiators, MyCom versus your other options? Well, it's quite interesting. I've worked with some very large companies, as you know, from my background, uh, most immediately joining MyCom after having been at uh, Amdocs, leading uh, the consulting and systems integration organization worldwide. But what I found really attractive at MyCom was not just the fact that this company, which started approximately 17 years ago, um, has an impressive track record, because as you know, there are many, many companies that start each and every day, but very few get to be in business for 17 years, and very few get to grow themselves to well over $100 million dollars in global revenues and whilst that may be impressive and exciting when I think about the fundamental market opportunity we have at MyCom to offer infrastructure services and software that help telecom operators design build operate optimize and monetize their network that was really exciting to me and having begun my career on the operator side gave me a unique perspective in looking at the full portfolio of, of MyCom and saying, wow, we could really make a difference in every aspect of the network investment life cycle. I got really excited by that, uh, talked to the founder and the investors and decided to cast my lot with MyCom and I'm very excited. Fantastic. What, what's your role? Can you uh, tell Thank me you. a bit more? Well, my role is uh, President and CEO of MyCom North America, which by far is the largest part of MyCom. And whilst the focus is intense in North America because it's such a huge market for us and there's so much upside to go from where we are today to approach multiplying the company in just the next several years. But whilst I'm very focused in North America for all those reasons, I also am keenly focused on helping the company grow our services business around the world, which leverages the fact that in some markets like Europe and parts of Asia, MyCom's software business, that software to help operators better manage their network, has been in existence and is used by many carriers. So we have a very unique chance to break in and grow much bigger in North America and then on the back of the business we already have in Europe and parts of Asia to grow the entire company including services. Okay, and can, can you tell me um, the skills that you're bringing into this role from Amdocs to probably the most recent one there and the role you came from? Great. Well, obviously um, at Amdocs, the company um, has a, a very large market-leading portfolio of what's commonly referred to as BSS and OSS capabilities for operators. And so that work allows me to have a very intimate and deep understanding of what it takes to run not just the network, but all the surrounding systems that when it comes together, allows the operator to do the one thing they want to do, build a network, fill it with customers and revenue and profit from that. At MyCom, we're more than just software in the OSS space. We have services that literally help carriers build their core and their mobile networks. We have services where a carrier can turn to MyCom and we could supplement and support the work they do in the design and engineering phase. So that combination of advanced engineering services, infrastructure and related services to build and operate, and then being able to offer the software that allow carriers to have incredible visibility into the performance of the network and how they can engineer the network to deliver the one thing they must do, which is monetize, monetize the network. So building a network is exciting, but what pays the bills is having it filled with profitable customers. And you actually have first-hand experience in, in terms of the bulk of your career running and being in an operator. Oh gosh, I'm, I'm very fortunate. I came out of university and went to work for AT&T. Then I moved over after a number of years into what became Verizon. I was there through a lot of the mergers that created Verizon as we know it today. Uh, did some other things in technology as well, but then came back to 
uh, telecom and the operator side and spent before Amdocs several years at, at Vodafone in roles in the U.S. but with responsibility for activity that expanded well outside the U.S. So, you know, my career has really been blessed in that I've spent, uh, you know, 25 plus years pretty much in every sector of telecom and importantly for my common our ambitions all around the world. Well, I really appreciate your time and wish you all the best in the role. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers.